What is going on everybody? Welcome back to another video. We're going to try to hunt down some native brookies today. We're uh, up in the mountains on a mountain stream. She's running a little fast. We, we just had like a half inch rain yesterday. So not the end of the world. It's still pretty clear, which is good. It's not stained or anything. Uh, yet again, I'm using the Shimano Stimula Ultralight Black and Yellow Panther Martin. And I have that set up with, I don't know if you guys can see that, but right there is a ball bearing swivel. I have six pound braid up here and then six pound fluorocarbon uh, coming off that ball bearing swivel. So that's the setup we're going to be rocking with for a little while today. Uh, so let's get fishing. I'm excited. Oh yeah. Hopefully, so last video, uh, my waders had sprung a leak. So hopefully, uh, I fixed them last night. Hopefully we don't get a wet foot today. Ooh. That might have been a fish. Ooh, fish. We got one, boys. It's a little one. It's a brookie. Oh, wow. Little brook trout. Oh, it's so cool. First hole, first brookie. Gonna let him go. See you, buddy. Cool. That's pretty good. I'm pretty sure my foot's already getting wet, which means I didn't find the leak like I thought I did. I'll tell you guys, waders, they are so hard to find a good pair. I've only had these like two or three months. They've already gotten a leak. Huh. Well, is it safe to say someone else fishes here? A net. Cool. Guess we got enough for the day because I forgot mine. Ooh, ooh. Just had a really. Ooh, got one. Ha! No! He got off. Damn. I don't know if that was the same fish following it twice or, or what. This is a hard hole to hit. It's always when there's a damn branch in the way. Good hole, there's a tree down. Oh, got one. There we go. It's hiding behind that rock. We'll use our free net. Yeah, let's go look at this guy. Keep him in the net. Good and safe. Whew. Man, these guys are slippery. Ay, ay, ay. These fish are beautiful. All right, that's two for the day. So that fish, oh, let me stand up. The fish came, what I think, at it behind this rock right here. That kind of tells me I can probably pick the water apart, so to speak, a little bit more. I wish the water wasn't so stinking high. Might make life a little easier, but it is what it is today. At least we're out. It was at her going turkey hunting. And I'm not much of a turkey hunter. I enjoy it, but I want to be able to make videos for you guys. And uh, turkey hunting's just so... You never know what's going to happen. I, guess, I mean, that's any kind of hunting, but... At least fishing, I'm confident I can catch a fish. Most of the time. Whew. Tell you what. Wading through this creek is a workout. Can't really see the bottom. The water's like that, that dark... I don't know, maybe the bottom's just dark, the water's clear. 
But man, it's hard to walk through here. <laughs> I broke that net. Well, that's unfortunate. I can't believe I'm gonna bite through this hole here. Oh, I'm gonna end up losing this, I can already tell. Oh, I got it. And ruin the hole. There we go. Oh, that was a good fish, guys. Oh, God, that's heartbreaking. Oh, man. That was a good eight inch brookie. Damn, that was our shot. Man, it is peaceful in here. You don't hear no one. There's no boot tracks anywhere. It's nice. Creek really changed. Got quiet. No more uh, rapids. The rocks kind of went away. Doesn't look all that fishy. I mean, not for a brook trout. This kind of seems like slow, stagnant water. There's, oh, I had one. Oh. Oh, I had another one, or the same one. Damn. I uh, either missed one or either missed one twice or two one time. I ain't gonna bite again, that's for sure. Yeah, that was my chance at those or that one. Tell you what, there's one hell of a massive hole right there. I can't even see the bottom of it. Oh, I got one. I got one. I, oh, man. Damn. <laughs> Underneath that log right there. Definitely uh, missed more than I caught today. Oh man, I thought I was stuck and it was a fish. Got him. That's a good fish. That's a good fish. Get him here. Ugh. No. We got him. We got him, got him, got him. Get a look at this guy real quick. Wow. I gotta let him go. Whew. That was a lot of work. This, this net doesn't, well, it has a quick disconnect, but I don't have the other end. Whew. That was a little difficult. Man, that was. That was a beautiful fish. That's, I don't know how big that was, but over six inches, I would assume. Beautiful, beautiful fish, man. Oh, it's so beautiful out here. Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get stuff wrapped back up and we're gonna keep uh, fishing. Let's try to catch some more.
Oh, that's a fish. Oh, I lost him. Reaching for the net. <sighs> that is unfortunate. Fish. There you go. Got him. All right, buddy. All right. Hoo-hoo, look at that. Man, these fish are beautiful. Well, boys, we just got back to the truck. What a day. I mean, well, what did we catch? Four fish, miss, maybe another four. Pretty good day. It just got, my hands are cold. My foot was so wet. Uh, so I called it. Had a lot of fun, though. We're definitely going to have to come back and fish it maybe when the water's lower. I think that might be key. So, all right, guys. I just want to say thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, leave a like, comment, subscribe. You know the deal. Until then, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.